Yee-haw! And welcome back to the Southern Snack, where life is too short to be serious. Folks, we're back at Arby's in Richmond. Richmond, yes. I've just never understood the concept of what they do here. Um, I just don't know if all the franchises just, they're like, okay, you know, let's just treat people in Richmond to some fun seasonal items. But, I mean, here we are like three years in of doing this and still I'm finding things I haven't reviewed maybe because I, you know, hadn't been in Richmond at the time when they did these last time. But, you know, I, I stopped by every time I go to Richmond just to check and see and I'm just amazed I'm just amazed they're not test market items um, at, at least I haven't seen any of them released nationwide yet um, does that mean they won't uh, no but I, I, it's just crazy like it's items that you, they they're not gonna have on a normal menu because it's like baked potatoes that are loaded with like chicken and this looks like a parmesan sauce and broccoli it's just crazy to me it's crazy the concept i just don't get how they do it but they must train these employees really well in richmond and say hey you know if you're new to richmond this is not your normal arby so get used to it but i hope you subscribe and like and comment on this video we're going to keep it short um, as short as we can but we've got the chocolate raspberry shake which I believe they had in the past again I didn't make it to Richmond and uh, when I did they had the brownie batter the chocolate brownie shake and then you've got the chicken divan which looks like it's got all kinds of cheese and there's some chicken and some broccoli so we're gonna pose for this thumbnail So there you go. I guess we'll eat first, see what, what we got here with this potato. And then, uh, you know, we'll, we'll uh, finish it off with a shake. Now, I didn't do my research on Chicken Devon. So if y'all want to tell me what it is, that would be cool. But um, that cheese is pretty good. I don't know if it's like Parmesan or mozzarella. I think it's Parmesan. It's like a cream of mushroom kind of sauce on there. Or like, it, it reminds me a little bit of chicken pot pie. Not too much chicken in here though. Mm. Yeah, it, it really gives off like, the chicken gives off like a rotisserie chicken vibe. Which I think they sell rotisserie chickens at this Arby's, which is again another crazy thing. Um, but it's like pulled chicken, potatoes, some cream sauce, and cheese to top it off. So it's kind of reminiscent of a pot pie in a way. Overall, it's it's pretty good. It's got some really good aspects to it, flavor profiles. It's definitely hearty, especially for a fast food place, you know. I say this time and time again when I come out to these Arby's. They have some really interesting items that are actually pretty good for you when it comes to fast food. So, I don't know what to say. Other than this is quite good, I'd give it a 7.5. It's nothing over the top or amazing, but I think it's solid. And the ingredients that go into it are pretty good it's not your normal arby's dish and, and i gotta give them credit they, they it's just crazy what they do out here but man you're just gonna blaze through the parking lot aren't you all right um so chocolate raspberry got chocolate sauce raspberry and then whipped cream with chocolate chips i'll go ahead and eat some of this whipped cream with the chocolate chips heck yeah Mm. That's refreshing, but is it shake refreshing? That's a big question. There's a solid amount of black raspberry. That's quite good. 
Reminds me of when I went to uh, Steak and Shake for the Black Raspberry Shake. Trying to get the chocolate syrup in here. And it adds a nice touch. I think one way you can make this shake better is putting chocolate chips throughout. It does have real raspberry in there. That's very interesting. So I'm talking through one of these soft pieces and it's it's raspberry. That is quite good. Maybe not the most amazing hearty shake I've Arby's shake I've ever had, but it's a nice blend of that tart and sweet black raspberry and that chocolatey syrup. These are two things that, whether you know it or not, actually pair quite well together. They go very well together, and it's a worthy combination to try. If you've never tried black raspberry and chocolate, I, I recommend it without a doubt. But yeah, it's a solid shake. It's hard not for me to drink it all, but I give it a solid 8 out of 10. Very enjoyable, very simplistic, but it's a unique combination that you're not going to find out a lot of fast food joints. So if you have an Arby's in Richmond, which you do, but if you're, if you're in Richmond and you're near an Arby's, they also brought back the brisket black and blue salad, which I've tried. And one other item that I don't remember. Oh, lima beans, which I've tried too. And the lima beans ain't bad either. So, interesting menu, guys. Give it a try. Check it out. Arby's locations in Richmond. Other than that, I'll see y'all around. Yee-yee!